Heating by sunlight is the source of energy for all changes in the weather. This heat evaporates water from oceans, lakes, and earth, and changes it into water vapor. The sun heats the earth and the oceans and lakes, and it causes the vapor to rise. As it rises, it cools and condenses and makes all the clouds that we see in the skies. All the clouds have been formed cause the land and sea were warmed, and the vapor goes up with the air. And you know that water evaporates when you see those clouds up there. Evaporation and condensation. The water cycle, the water cycle. Followed by precipitation. The water cycle, the water cycle. The never ending cycle is taking place all the time and everywhere. The sun heats the earth and the oceans and lakes and it causes the vapor to rise. As it rises it cools and condenses and makes all the clouds that we see in the skies. All the clouds have been formed cause the land and sea were warmed and the vapor goes up with the air. And you know that water evaporates when you see those clouds up there. Evaporation and condensation The water cycle, the water cycle Followed by precipitation The water cycle, the water cycle The never-ending cycle is taking place All the time and everywhere The rain and the hail and the sleet and the snow Falling down on the land and the sea Fill the lakes and the ponds and the rivers that flow To the oceans continually And the heat-giving sun just repeats what it has done And the vapor goes up with the air That water can circulate when you see those clouds up there. Evaporation and condensation. The water cycle, the water cycle. Followed by precipitation. The water cycle, the water cycle. The never ending cycle is taking place all the time and everywhere.